If you're wondering how you can win this bike, check out the link in the description box. Enjoy the video. Shown here from SRK Cycles with a 2006 Suzuki Boulevard C50. But it's got the windshield, like the C50T would. Normally the C50T, like that one, has bags, backrest, windshield. This one just doesn't have those things, but that's awesome. Let's take it for a spin. <clears throat> I'm going to tell you guys why this might be a better bike for you to buy than a Harley Davidson Sportster. If you're looking for an entry level bike and you are a adult male like I am. What is that rattle? Is it the windshield? I don't know. Something, some, some little piece. Is there a bell on this bike? I don't know. Alright guys, let's start the day with the words of wisdom. Matthew 19, 26. And looking at them, Jesus said to them, With people, this is impossible. But with God, all things are possible. Hey, fella. Alright, so one of the cool things I like about this bike, I'm 6'2". I fit... Oh, there we go. I fit great on this bike. I mean, it's a 50 cubic inch which means it's an 800cc bike. It's got plenty of power. Plenty of power for you and someone to go on the back. Even if you're a bigger guy, it's got plenty of power. I mean, it's no C90. It's no M109. But it still has plenty of power. But from looking at it, it's a big framed bike. It's got a big white tank. Everything about it looks big. You're never going to feel like, uh, I'm too small riding this bike. Which, I'm not going to lie, I oftentimes feel when I'm riding a Sportster. Although I know it's okay because it's a Harley. And I'm like, okay, people know. Harley guys know. They probably have one in their garage themselves. <clears throat> but, why get something like that when you can spend way less... Get a newer Suzuki, which much less miles, and it's probably going to be a little cheaper to maintain. And it's just a big feeling bike. I love how they have these big, wide handlebars. It's such a nice, it's very like Road King feel. Another cool thing about the C50s is um, when they came out, they're all fuel injected. All of them gotta love fuel injection you hop on the bike you press the button fire it up I forget we have this bike listed for but I know it was pretty cheap watch watch it accelerate it's not like it's not pulling your arms off but it moves it's probably faster than your car, depending on what you drive. Should, maybe not, I don't know. Windshield's nice. That windshield from Switchblade would probably be about, I don't know, 250 to 300 bucks. It's already on there. We don't charge any more for it. It's just, who cares? It's on there. I don't like the looks of windshields, but I know a lot of people do. I don't actually mind this one. It's, 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 it's fairly clear. I'm looking through it. I don't really notice that it's on there. I kind of forget. Keeps that wind from hitting my chest, although my chest is strong enough that if it hits me, I just punch it away. It's no big deal. Guys, 10,000 miles, these bikes, these bikes can run as long as any other bike out there. You just don't see them. You just don't see them do it because, I don't know, maybe it's just more of like this side of the country doesn't see it happen. Airplane. Guys, this bike runs good. Uh, I, I haven't counted the, sh the gears, but I'm pretty sure it's a five-speed. It runs good, 10,000 miles, 10,217 miles. The clutch is not slipping. Tires look good. It's got these crash bars. It's got your heel-toe shifter. 
I mean, it's got all the things you would want in a larger bike, except for it's going to be cheaper. It's also, it's, it, these are pretty light feeling bikes. They, they do feel very light. They also feel very nim fairly nimble. You could definitely drag some bag. Although if you uh, if you're looking at one of these and you don't like this is more of a touring classic look and you're looking for more of like a aggressive look, maybe you should look into like the uh, the M50s or the M90s. Because that's the more that's gonna have pegs and that's a little more a little more aggressive. The color scheme is gonna be a little more orange and black and green and cool things like that. This is more the uh, the classic touring bike C50. Maybe C stands for classic. Maybe M stands for monster. I don't know. Guys, that wraps up the test drive for this C50. We'll catch you guys later. I'm Sean. This is SRK Cycles. Remember, it's not what you ride. But where are you going? Oh, yeah, don't forget. Don't forget. We're doing a motorcycle giveaway. Check it out. Link on below. All right, guys. See you later. What's up, guys? Sean from SRK Cycles. Thanks for watching the video. Click right here to subscribe. Click right here to check out our new Bikes and Beer channel. And click down here to see how you can win a motorcycle. See you guys later.